easy. Put your hands up. Hey, right, they're up. See, your friend owes me money, Mr. Drake. A lot of money. So when he told me that you two were onto something big, the find of a lifetime, he said, well, I was intrigued. But he's made grand promises before, haven't you, Victor? And here we are again. Another fool's errand. Jeez, does he always go on like this? Take it easy, Navarro. <laughs> so, I'm afraid the time is up. Unless, of course, you found something in there, Mr. Drake, that might compensate for all this unpleasantness. He's screwing with the innate. They heard everything. Just give him the map. Slowly. What does a Krieg's marine map have to do with El Dorado? What? You think this is a coincidence? The Germans were after the same treasure. That map has something to do with it. So? We're square? For now. But just in case you need a reminder... Hey, come Ooh. on, leave him out of it. Yeah, don't you guys usually just cut off a finger or something? <laughs> That's far too vulgar. No, I think this will hurt him a bit more. Now, whoa, whoa, whoa. Come on, Roman. He's got nothing to do... Sully! Sully! You son of a bitch! Cowboy. Oh. That's relieving Ow. me at the dock. What the hell are you doing here? Listen, I'm a good enough reporter to follow a couple of no-luck tomb robbers. Shh. It went this way. I radio ahead. Well, you're down to one tomb robber now. Sully's dead. What? Yeah. And we're next if we don't get out of here. Oh, God. I'm, I'm sorry. Please tell me you have a gun. Of course. Oh, thanks. All right, come on. Okay. 